Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Leon. So in this video, I'm going to be going over how to replace uh, and upgrade your headlight bulbs for a 2021 Nissan Versa. To uh, be clear, this is the S model. Uh, this is the manual transmission. Uh, the headlight bulbs are not the brightest. I think they're, they're H11 uh, headlight bulbs. And I'm going to be upgrading them, or I've already upgraded them to uh, LED bulbs. And I'll say this is by far the best mod I've done to this car, the best upgrade I've done to the car. The ones I purchased were on Amazon. I'm going to link them in the description box. Uh, they're LED bulbs. A pair is $32 uh, plus tax. Uh, they're real easy to change out. What I did is I changed all four bulbs out, so the high and low beams. And I'll show you how to do it. So it's pretty straightforward. So what's good about this car is that um, unlike some older Nissans, uh, the headlight bulbs are real easy to get to. They're actually right um, in front of the car or, or right at the top. Because some of, some cars, the headlights, headlight bulbs are like in the bumper. And those are a little bit harder to get to. But you see that these little panels here are the headlights bulbs themselves. So there's a panel and there's a... Um, and for these, there there is a, a ballast here. So this little this little rectangular pieces is the ballast and you see that there are two connectors those connect to the existing wiring in the car so this is the wiring harness and these are the existing connectors right here so I'll show you how to change them out they're real simple so basically this tab here on your existing headlights uh, you're gonna turn this uh, you're gonna turn this counterclockwise so you turn it counterclockwise and it comes out and you just change out the um, you're gonna go ahead and unplug that panel there or that little um, piece and you just replace the old ones with the new ones and by the way you see me wearing gloves uh, you need gloves because you don't want any kind of um, you don't want any kind of um, any kind of dirt or, or uh, oil on the um, on the bulbs that's because um, the bulbs will get a hot spot and they'll burn out faster so you, you want to do that and sometimes it's a little bit harder to, to get them back in but what's good is that when they go back in they go back in snug kind of always have a problem with this because because when I put them in I had this this same problem but when they go in they go in pretty easily once you get them and you, you may have to just turn them a little bit more to kind of make sure they fit in there but when they fit you see when they fit here they fit snug and then you're just gonna go back and turn it clockwise again and it's gonna fit snug in there so that's how you know uh, it goes in there correctly and it's just the same thing on both sides and there's a piece of double-sided tape that comes with the kit that tape will secure it to the the vehicle so when the car vibrates and things like that you don't have to worry about it unhooking also the connections are really really secure so really, you could probably go go go. Um, you could probably go off roading with this, and you wouldn't have any problems with it. Um, and um, this, it's the same way on the other side. It's where um, basically you same way you you turn it uh, counterclockwise to take it apart, and when you put it back in, it's gonna go back snug, and you just turn it back clockwise. Uh, I would have to admit this is probably the best upgrade for the car as far as uh, lighting. It's very cheap, uh, very inexpensive. Uh, the kit itself, it comes with these gloves which is really awesome. Actually each kit comes with a set of gloves. Um, the piece of double sided tape, the connections themselves. So this piece here, this piece, um, this part here is the wiring harness itself. This is the wiring harness. but this piece here is all one piece and like I said it comes with uh, the bulbs themselves the LED bulbs it comes with the um, the zip ties the double-sided tape these gloves and the instruction manual and what I've done I, I just kept the original bulbs with me and just in case I need them uh, and, but one, one thing I would recommend doing is that they're they're rated for 50,000 hours but I would definitely maybe buy just a third set if you plan on upgrading your high and low beams, I say that because in the event that one of your bulbs goes out, 
you'll be able to have another set. And uh, I wouldn't open that set up. I would just keep it sealed. And this is how it looks here. This is the actual um, brand here. So the brand is Sea Light, and uh, the uh, it's called uh, it's called a uh, Zenover. Oh, Zenover uh, LED lighting. Uh, it's a Chinese brand, uh, and you see here it's the uh, the XI. The H8, H9, H11, H16. I think these bulbs are H11s. I believe they are. So yeah, um, like I said, I think this is probably one of the best upgrades, in my opinion, as far as the car. And um, I'm gonna actually do a. I'm gonna provide some pictures and some videos of the before and after. It's definitely a big difference. Uh, I definitely recommend these, and especially anybody that has trouble seeing at night. These are. This is definitely a real easy upgrade. You can either do it yourself or you can get somebody to, to do it for you for, for pretty cheap. So yeah, uh, let me know what you think in the comment section. Uh, and like I said, right at the end of the video, I'm going to just do some before and after comparisons on, on the lighting. Because I was able to, to like get a light pattern just off of a uh, off fence and then one off a building. So that way you can see the difference. But it's definitely a big difference. I can definitely see a lot better with these. So hopefully you found the video helpful. If you did, please sure, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, and uh, you have a blessed day. You take care.